quick neck brace update um, because I'm noticing a lot of changes. Um, so I've been wearing my neck brace for about two months now. At the beginning, um, I'll kind of move through the progression. So when I first started wearing it, I had very high expectations because I'd been dreaming for years of having a neck brace. Um, just because I thought that would be really helpful to give my head some stability. So putting the neck brace on was a bit disappointing because it didn't do quite what I thought it should do. It felt like um, it was just kind of like here and my head was floating on it. It caused a lot of muscle pain. I didn't wear it very much. I would take it off as soon as I couldn't tolerate the pain anymore. Um, so it was like a little disappointing and upsetting. And in my research, I had seen a lot of people talk about how the neck brace was kind of like a trial for them on if a fusion fusion surgery would be useful. And so I was feeling really let down um, that the neck brace wasn't helpful and that a fusion would not be helpful for me. So after I got through a couple weeks of that, I started being able to tolerate my neck brace more and more. And I realized that the pain in my back was because the neck brace holds my posture a different way than I'm used to. Um, so it was kind of my muscles getting used to that. And I also realized that my neck brace wasn't quite fitted right. So I worked with my physical therapist and she bumped it up a notch. And now, as you can see, it is holding my head and neck much better. Honestly, I still think it could go up another one, but it's as high as it can get. I just have um, a weirdly long neck. But that was, um, I would say, several weeks into wearing it, probably right around when I made my last neck brace update video. Um, so now I've been wearing it about another month from that. I'm noticing immense differences just within the last month. I rarely take my neck brace off at all, ever anymore. Um, last night I was laying on the couch with my neck braced. So I decided to take it off so I could kind of like stretch some muscles in here. And taking it off, even with my neck braced on something else, I pretty immediately got violently ill um, and nauseous. Um, it was really bad. I really just don't take it off at all anymore. And I had spoke with my physical therapist who um, focuses in EDS. And she said that it's likely due to my body is no longer used to the brainstem compression. Um, so over the years, it's had to kind of get used to living like that almost to cope with it. Um, and now that I have the neck brace on and it's holding things how and where they should be, um, when I take it off, it's kind of like a shock or like trauma to my body going back to that compression, not gradually. Um, so it just kind of freaks my body out. Um, I am noticing a lot of results and I don't know if it's because they happened slowly and I didn't notice it or because they happened extremely quickly and I didn't notice it, but I have zero neck pain. Zero. I have had no neck pain in weeks to the point where I'm like gaslighting myself. Like, did I ever have neck pain? Am I making this all up? My neck does not hurt at all. I have had pretty steady neck pain since I was 16 and I injured my neck. Um, like ranging from it's uncomfortable to I can barely move it hurts so bad. Um, so it's very weird to not have neck pain. I also am noticing that I have much less tingling and numbness. Before wearing the neck brace, uh, my extremities and kind of like my face and the back of my head were pretty much always either numb or tingling. Um, and I've had not much of that at all. Um, I'm also noticing I have no muscle pain. I still do have a bit of muscle pain lower just because my body is still getting used to the posture from this. But before wearing my neck brace right here and my shoulders, like up through my neck, um, here, there were just like rock hard balls of muscle tension permanently always. Um, I pretty much could ask my husband for a massage every second of every day and he could never get 
all the knots out. Um, it was always a mess. It was always painful. I would just be sitting here all the time, like massaging um, the worst spots. And I have no muscle pain, which is just bizarre. Um, so all of this is really, really good because it's showing kind of like a trial um, without officially being one that the fusion should should do some good things for me. I am 100% not symptom free. In fact, my symptoms are getting worse and worse every day. But there are those three areas, um, the neck pain, muscle pain and numbness tingling that have drastically declined. Um, and so kind of what I'm feeling now, I've been told is a pretty good indication of what it might be like post surgery for me. Um, so will my surgery cure everything? No, probably not. And I'm going into it knowing that, but there's a pretty good chance that it could help with these three things at least. Um, you know, and if we can get these three things taken care of, then I can focus on some of the other things. My most debilitating symptom still is POTS stuff. Um, I can barely stand up for even a moment without needing to faint. I'm not under the impression that the fusion will cure my POTS. I, in fact, have heard for most people it doesn't, but maybe if the fusion can even dial things back a little bit, um, then there's other ways we can work with the POTS. There are medicines, you know, there are other treatment ideas and options that we can look at post fusion. So I'm very, very pleased with my neck brace, um, having a very positive experience, but I did um, just want to put this out there because the beginning for me was really rough and I was very uncomfortable. I felt like the neck brace was doing more harm than good. Um, I felt like it wasn't working for me. Um, so if anybody else is kind of in that weird space with their neck brace, I would just encourage you to keep trying. Um, you know, it's not something that is just going to happen overnight um, and to keep positive about it. And if things aren't feeling right to you, reach out to professionals, reach out to your doctors. Things weren't feeling quite right for me with my neck brace and I was able to work with people to get it exactly where it needed to be for me. So yeah, I'm having a very positive neck brace experience. I really never want to take it off again, but I'm hopeful that the fusion will act as an internal neck brace. And, you know, one day I can pick my grandkids up without having a neck brace on.